African elephants, as well as being the largest animals to walk the planet, also have the most recognisable body part in the entire animal kingdom. It's a marvel of the animal world. No other creature has anything quite like it. Why do elephants have trunks? OK, zebras have stripes and giraffes, that long neck. But even so, at up to seven feet long, an elephant's trunk really does stand out in a crowd. And it's versatile. It can reach branches up to 20 feet high and is strong enough to lift over 700 pounds. And its sense of smell is up to four times more sensitive than a bloodhound's. And they've learned to use it in incredible ways. By holding the tips of their trunks above the water's surface, elephants can cross rivers and even bays virtually submerged. That's right, they've learned to use a purpose-built snorkel. Some better than others. Living in herds of up to 100, Elephants also use their supersized schnoz to trumpet warnings and greet one another. Ah! Hello! Because they have deep family bonds, they even use their trunks to comfort and caress. It's like a big grey arm around your shoulder saying, Don't worry, my friend. Everything's gonna be just fine. So, an elephant's trunk is long, strong and always there when things go wrong. But how is this marvellous nose capable of doing so many things? At the Adventures with Elephant Sanctuary in South Africa, Dr Stephanie Slade has been working with Shishuru for three years. Stephanie set up a series of tests to reveal the secret of the trunk's versatility. First, a drinking test. Step one. Slosh the water around a bit. Step two, spray the camera crew. And step three, take a well-earned drink. Good boy. Good, Shishuru. It's just like your nostrils, that, that trunk goes directly to the lungs, not to the stomach or any digestive area. So they'll fill the trunk with water and then immediately transfer that water to their mouth to swallow. So, how does his incredible trunk do this? Well, the human body is made up of 850 muscles, but an elephant's trunk is made up of more than 40,000. This vast muscle network enables them to lift, twist and move any part of their trunk from the base to the very tip. So these huge, strong muscles within the trunk are constricting and widening to allow those two nostrils to be larger to accommodate all of the water that they can suck up and hold at one time. An elephant can hold up to two gallons in its trunk in one gulp. And there's more to these neat noses. Elephants have a number of ways to use their dynamic trunk to pick things up. So we're gonna start with just cubed apples and segmented oranges. Shishuru is using something unique to the African elephant. Two finger-like points at the tip of his trunk. By pinching together these two opposing tips, they can grasp objects smaller than a pin, making Shishuru's tremendous trunk the perfect pickup. Oh boy. Now we're gonna try the absolute hardest task that we can come up with. What about a fine powder? It's right there. This is ground flax, also known as linseed. Shishuru has never come across powdered food like this before. So you can see him expanding the tip of his trunk to smell and to see what it is. It's not moving, so he's not using suction. Is the lack of something to grip too much for even Shishuru's talented trunk? That's incredible. He's using the side of those fingers just as you would sweep something off of a countertop. This is as much brain work as it is trunk work. Let's see how Chova, an elephant who sadly lost the tip of his trunk, manages the powdered seeds. Uh, 
amazing. To be able to survive in an adapting environment, they need something that's strong and delicate. That's all of those things combined into just one organism. They can adapt it and use it however they need. It really is the most useful device an animal can have. It is the all-in-one trunk.